Hi ladies! Okay, so today I'm going to demonstrate the sock bun. It is something that everybody's been doing and they've probably been doing it for a couple years and I jumped on the bandwagon a while ago because my hair is unruly and you guys know I don't really know how to do my hair that well. So this is something that's super, super simple. You'll find tons of YouTube videos, probably better lighting than mine, but my camera's out of battery so I'm using my computer today. And you're going to be having the gorgeous background of my living room. So. Anyway, what you'll need for this tutorial, a comb, a couple of elastics. I like to have one that's super, super big and stretchy, and then one not so much. Just some random bobby pins. I have big ones and small ones. Scissors and a sock, or in my case, two socks. I have long, long hair, and it's super, super thick, and I like my bun to be big. I like big Okay, I'm not going to finish that. Um, basically, you can make it with one sock if you have thin hair, two socks if you have thick hair, or if you just want your bun to be bigger, use a longer and a couple socks. Uh, if you want a petite bun, I could still do that even though I have a lot of hair by just using one sock and maybe one that's a little bit shorter. So you take your trouser socks. Mine literally is, they're both inside of each other. I did not steal this from my husband. And you're going to want to cut off the toe section. Literally the toe was about right here. And I just snipped, snipped that part off. Then you're going to make your donut. So you're going to take the top and you're just going to roll it. Try to keep it a small roll because it will get bigger. And what you're left with is a donut basically. See the hole in there? Okay, it doesn't need to be perfect. This is the perfect thickness for me. I like a big bun. So then I'm gonna take one of my elastics, not the larger one, and I'm going to smooth out my hair. Now I've done the ballerina bun before and that one I've added a bow to it. This one's a little bit different because it's a lot lower, obviously. And of course, I am gonna add a flower. How could I be me and not add a flower? Now, a lot of girls in their YouTube videos will take their hair, put the sock bun in it, and then roll it down and stuff their hair in. I can't do that. I am not talented enough, and it makes my arms hurt. Ugh. It gets awful, like, trying to hold it up there. So, I literally put mine on just like you would a scrunchie back in the 80s and 90s right in there, okay? Then what I do is I flip my hair over. Can you see? Yeah. And what I'm doing is I'm covering the sock with all of this hair. So I'm pushing it over, feeling around, making sure that sock is completely covered. Now I take this large rubber band and just go over the both of those, okay? Now I've got all this extra hair that's looking kind of crazy. Um, one thing to say about the sock bun too, choose your color wisely. I mean, if you have blonde hair, obviously choose like a tan sock. And if you have darker hair like mine, choose a black or a brown. So I take all of my hair that's back here and all around, and I just pull it to one side. And I start twisting it. And I twist and twist and twist and twist and twist until it goes all the way around the sock bun. Then I just take my large bobby pins and start pinning that extra hair in. Girls in the military, you'll notice their buns are like, <laughs> it sounds so bad no matter how I say it. You'll notice their buns are amazing. Um, but yeah, you'll notice that their hair looks amazing and it's because of the sock bun. And then I just like to put a couple bobby pins in my hair right here. And then right here. Oh, I forgot my flower. How could I? I'll be right back. Okay, so I got my flower and I just... Put it in like that and then 
Mine's getting a little bit wobbly, so I take a small bobby pin. Grab the back and just put it into place so it's not wobbly anymore. But anyway, there's the sock bun. It is a perfect hairstyle to do when your hair is kind of unruly and not really working that well for you. And it just is sleek. It's nice. It's easy. Other adjectives can be used to describe the sock bun. It definitely gives your hair a boost. It's really, really fun. And you can wear this way up high. You can do this with curly hair, straight hair, whatever, and just play around with it. Different textures create different buns, and then different socks, the thickness, the style, everything. And you can just have so much fun with it. Um, this would also be great for Princess Leia if you're going to be her for Halloween. You can put those two right there on the side, especially if you want to take this extra hair that comes out kind of all around, braid it first, and then wrap it around the sock bun. That would look great. So anyway, hope you guys liked it and that you do it and send me some pictures and I'll talk to you later. Bye.